In this video, I'm going to show you some soaps and matching fragrances that work for me. Stick around. Time and time again, I hear men comment on the labyrinth that is soap and fragrance matching. Of course, as with most things in grooming, the ultimate decision is yours. It's a very subjective exercise. These pairings work particularly well for me and my set of circumstances. So let's take a look at some of my favorites. Truffitt and Hills 1805. I like to pair this with La Ligue Enquête Noire. There are top notes of cypress, middle notes of vetiver, base notes of musk, cashmere and wood. This is so complex and rich. I really love this fragrance and I think that it works very well with 1805. I think Isimiyaki is an exact match and that would have been a little too obvious and not very interesting. Give La Ligue en Coin Noir a go. Next we have Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements, Gondolier. Now, this particular soap works very, very well with Aqua di Parma's Bleu Mediterranean Mirto di Panerea. Now, this is the Mediterranean and Italy in a bottle. Mirto di Panerea accentuates the sensual side and regenerates your body and soul with aromatic aromas of myrtle, citrus, Calabrian lemon, and sweet passionate orange with calming effects of basil. The middle notes then develop with aromas of jasmine, rose, and green lilac. Uh, which then meets a sea breeze with black currant leaves. The base notes we find accords of woodiness, juniper, cedar, and warm amber. Another soap that works very well with this particular fragrance is Razor Rock's Double X. Next we have Barrister and Man Vetiver, Heather, and Clary Sage. Now the match for this is Vetiver Guerlain for Men. It was created way back in 1961 and then relaunched again in 2000. The top notes are bergamot, coriander, lemon, mandarin, and neroli. And the middle notes unites vetiver and cedar wood. The base is composed of tobacco, walnuts, pepper, and tonka bean. This is one of my favorite all-time fragrances. It is a beautiful fragrance and works very well with the offering from Barrister and Man. Next, we have Katie's Bubbles, Le Piment de la Vie. And for this, I pair it with Eau de l'Ebol L'Occitan en Provence. Or now, this. What sort of notes do we have here? The notes here are pink, pepper, and cardamom. Cypress and incense, vanilla, and tonka bean. Now, this is one of those fragrances that is almost a dead ringer. It's a very, very close match and works beautifully. Next one is Soap Commander's Respect. And with this, I match Aqua de Colonia Concentrada Alfarez Gomez which is made in Spain. Now this fragrance features lavender, bergamot, geranium and lemon, but don't fear the flower, gentlemen. It soon withers away to leave a wonderful waft of citrusy goodness. The other soap that I would match this with would be with Geo F. Trumper's Limes. Remember, all of this is subjective. These are just some guidelines. Now other things may work for you. Uh, lilac vegetal, for instance work for me, but it might work for you, and that's fine. The point that I wish to make is that there are no right or wrong pairings. If a combination works for you, then stick with it. Thanks for watching.